Hey, what's going on there, folks? Earthmaster here, checking in. Kind of late, I know. A little bit late, uh, but it's all good here on this Monday evening. Almost 9 p.m. here on the West Coast here in California. West Coast time. Taking a look at the Earthquake 3D globe here. See quite, We're seeing quite a bit of earthquake activity out here around Central America region. Uh, Northern South America as well, right around Costa Rica area. Quite a few fours popping off here uh, out there in the Pacific and right around the region of Costa Rica. A 5.2 down there in South America, the largest in that sequence. Still kind of monitoring that area as we may see something um, on the uptick out there. Right now, uh, just kind of monitoring it. West Coast is looking relatively quiet. Uh, there's some small earthquake activity out there in Southern California. No swarming, no uh, no unusual activity, right? Unusual meaning outside of the normal plate boundary, uh, plate tectonic boundary out there. Uh, just pretty much normal earthquake activity out there on the West Coast. Between the Pacific and the North American plate out here in the Western Pacific. Uh, things are calming down a tad bit. 5.3 north of the Philippines Island region. And a couple fours off the coast of Japan. Uh, no major earthquakes to report out there. Uh, 5.1 out here in the middle of the ocean. Out here, way out here. Nobody uh, seeing anything or hearing anything about it, right? That's the mid-Indian ridge, uh, Indian Ocean out there. This region right here, uh, very historical seismic activity. Uh, there's a lot going on out there over over the years. So this uh, is not an abnormal earthquake, so to speak. Very uh, uh, active when it comes to historical seismic activity out there in the Indian Ocean. Uh, other than that, folks, it's looking relatively quiet. I mean, for the most part, we did see a little bit of earthquake swarming out there in Yellowstone National Park. Um, not today, but over the past couple days, right? Uh, prior to 24 hours ago, I would say. We've seen a little bit of swarming going on. And uh, that uh, was pretty interesting to watch, but uh, not uh, not abnormal, I guess I could say is the word. Uh, it's pretty much we see these swarms happen um, over time. Here's a little bit closer look of the uh, Costa Rica region real quick. I know quite a few folks been asking about it you know what's going on out there in Costa Rica well there's only a couple four uh, 4.0 magnitudes out there 4.7 being the largest magnitude out there around the Costa Rica Ridge region northwest of the region I should say uh, northwest of San Jose well northwest of San Jose and taking a look at the last seven days of earthquake activity over the region and this will include all magnitudes uh we're looking at pretty much the same deal no major swarming going on no significant earthquakes out there in the area in the region i should say <coughs> excuse me so uh kind of just monitoring the region uh, i know a lot of folks are concerned about it but uh aside from the four pointers out there i don't think we're going to see anything too major out there <coughs> excuse me i once again i do not have the coronavirus <laughs> i'm alive and well let me tell you just a little cough this evening anyway folks uh yeah i mean it's it's just another day in the earthquake department another day in this uh, beautiful globe that we live on here uh, earthquakes and plate tectonics at work right here. Otherwise, imagine all this. Imagine all the earthquakes that were. If, what would happen if all the earthquakes were to stop? Really, what would happen? I think we would be in trouble. So I think we need to appreciate uh, all the plate tectonics and movement that's going on out there to create this beautiful landscape that we live on.
So yeah, there's another uh, 2.6 out there around the Puerto Rico region. Still seeing some earthquake activity out there, folks. Um, anyway, uh, you know, play safe out there, folks. Just be prepared. It's a, it's a giant globe out there, and anything can happen anywhere, any place, any time. Uh, right now, Texas kind of calming down. I know I had a, quite a few uh, questions in regards to Texas earthquake activity. Uh, taking a look at the last couple days here, uh, the last earthquake, a 3.6 out there on the earthquake 3D globe, they did see um, some larger earthquake activity over there over the past week with that 5.0 earthquake striking out there around the Pecos, Texas region, West Texas area. But like I mentioned, since then, earthquake activity has uh, dramatically calmed down with that 3.6 being the, the latest earthquake out there um, over the last week. Anyway, folks, um, have a good evening out there. Just a short, quick update. Um, got any questions or concerns, please leave a comment in the live stream video and I will try to get back to you. We're trying to... Uh, trying to find a couple more moderators for this channel so if you are interested please let me know in the live stream below have a good night folks we'll chat you guys a little bit later peace out